three. I'm not gonna spend all morning on this, but uh, that's it. You know, you know, indifference attracts indifference. I can't say that enough. So it's like just what he said. It's not so much what you guys are thinking. You know, he was a charlatan and he ripped people off. And why did he charge people to join his uh his organization? Well, he has to charge people. Your boss charges you to work and you get a paycheck at the end of the week. Is he being wrong for fucking uh, charging you, making you work? That's You're working, so you're being charged, right? Pretty much. You're using your body to move around and lift boxes or whatnot or make phone calls. Okay, so in this change to that, you get money. So there you go. So this change for you giving Anton LeBay money, you're learning about something that's really powerful. Satanism is a very powerful practice. You live life like it is, you know. You live life. It's not, well, I know you guys are saying, well, he said he don't like people, don't want people, and don't need people. Well, I don't blame him. Can you trust human beings? Can you trust a man? Can you trust woman? They fuck you over. They cheat on you. They stab you in the fucking back. They say they love you, and the next day they sleep around with someone else. So that's what he meant. Love what you can, I like you what you can give me, which means if you got nothing to give me and I'm giving and giving and giving, then what the fuck? Where's my time at? Where are you going to give me? So that's what he meant. So I'm debunking a lot of shit that you idiots say about him. He's not a charlatan. Uh, he was not a thief. In my case, uh, Alistair Crowley was a fucking retard that sat around with this fucking uh, pyramid on his head, and he was an idiot. I know Ozzy made a song about him. I really don't give a damn. I think Ozzy should have made a song about Anton LaVey. should have called it Mr. LaVey instead of Mr. Crowley. Mr. Crowley was a, a fucking idiot. And like I said, I'm going to look a lot of shit on this video. Because like all my other videos, this is going to be going on YouTube as well. So like I said, I'll block you. I don't give a fuck. I'll block you. Say some stupid, nasty, you be mean. I'll just block you. I'm not going to put up with this shit on me. I don't put up with this shit with people outside of you know, the fire off the computer. I'm not going to put up with people on it. You can subscribe if you want. You got something negative or nasty to say, you can just fuck yourself. Because I'm just giving you proof of what really happened. Not this little bullshit you guys are reading and he abuses kids. And that was not true. You know, Anton LaVey was a very busy man where I, wrote, where I read. He was part of a circus. Yes, he did drop out of school at 17, but at least he done something with his life. And that's what it is. Of course, Christians are not going to like Anton. They're going to get the media to say shit. Some idiot sent behind a fucking thousand dollar fucking notebook typing away like this fucking uh, keyboard fanatic. So, of course, someone don't like you, they're going to talk shit on you, you know. But now, like Blanche said, he's not alive. So now you guys can do that. But if he was alive, you would have a hard time doing that. It's like he's not with us anymore. So, of course, of course, you can talk shit on him because now it's a weak situation where he isn't alive. But Peter H. Gilmore, he showed you what was up. He moved in there. He showed, okay, this guy's dead. You got to keep his legacy going on. So people like me and people who are like from my realm, people who I'm into, that's all that matters. We will keep Anton LaVey alive, just like a lot of our singers that are not with us. Same thing. We'll keep them alive. That's all that matters. We don't need uh, people who blame him for being a charlatan or People blame him for being a thief and saying he abuses kids. That's all bullshit. Look around. Everything you see is, is Anton. I don't see nothing with Crawley's fucking face on it anywhere. Once in a lifetime, I say a few t-shirts here and there. But I don't see Crawley's stuff nowhere. Not at all. So like I said, I'm probably going to get a lot of shit on this video. And Well, you didn't read your research right. And believe me, I've I, I done my research. and I'm not saying I've done all of it. But I've done enough to know the facts. To know how Anton LaVey really was. He's not a thief. And those of you can say that, you're, you're probably a thief yourself. You can go fuck yourself. You're stupid. Uh, this is my channel, and I'll do what I want. Now, an opinion is a totally different scenario. An opinion, and you're just being a fucking dick or a bitch. It won't be tolerated. It will not be tolerated. So, with that being said, you know, that was it. Anton LaVey was not a thief. He's not a charlatan, and that's what he meant by that. Uh... If someone doesn't make sexual advantages towards you, that's what he meant. No, you know, wait on maybe signal. Maybe it wasn't meant to be. Same thing with friendship, you know. I, a lot of girls now don't talk to me. 
for no reason. They'll send me gifts and this and this. Don't talk to me. That's fine. Life goes on. Uh, you're a bitch anyway. You know, whatever. Life goes on. I'm not gonna sit up here and beg and plead for you to be my friend. I I left girls, you know, text messages and and record messages on on Facebook. Facebook got this calling app now. I get a reply. I'm like, okay, she's a fucking bitch. We're just friends a year ago. Now you're a bitch, but. You know, you're not better than anybody. You're just another broad, so that's about it. But uh, that's it. Got any questions, ask away. Uh, subscribe if you already have not done so. My Facebook, Donovan Kelly at Facebook. Look for the second picture. It's the second, not the first, not the third, not the fifth, not, not the sixth, seventh, eighth. Um, look for the second picture. You'll see a picture of a black crow sitting on top of a street lamp post. And it was in broad daylight. I took that picture in 2013. And that crow was only meant for me because that crow sat there like it knew I was taking a picture of it. See, here I am questioning and, and, and you know, questioning things and seeing reality for what it is. Or being a Satanist too, questioning everything. Why is that crow sitting on that lamppost that day? No one else saw it. It didn't stay there for anybody else. Um, at that picture, it's Donovan Kelly, D-O-N-O-V-A-N-K-E-L-L-E-Y. The Oracle Costume Making Service is my page I made up. I make all those costumes you see, with the exception of one costume is the devil costume. I didn't make that. I bought that from a, a place called Party City out here where I uh, live at, for side at in this area. It was about $35. We ended up, you know, just alternating. But all the other costumes you see, the chainsaw, even the chainsaw, all the props, those are all me. I made those myself. Nobody else give you any bullshit. Don't believe me. I made the Harley Quinn hammer. I made it all myself. That's what I'm into. I'm a Satanist, soon to be. I'm a Satan practitioner right now for the time being currently. I'm a traveler. I cook. Uh, I sing. I make props. I, you know, I make puppet shows. I got a, dis a puppet show display called the Yard of Darkness. It's a Grim Reaper playing in a, uh, in a playground tire swing. I've done all that stuff. So I'm living my life. That's all. You know, I. So I knit, I make costumes, I do all that stuff. Um, that's it. Um, subscribe to Coffee Babe on YouTube. If you already have not done so, like my page, Oracle Costume Service on Facebook. Do the costume or prop made. I'm the person to go to for that. Um, nothing is too hard for me. It takes time to do stuff. You know, of course, I have to go out and buy materials. Or sometimes we have materials here. You know, I pay my friend back. But, uh, you know, send a dwarf draft. There's a number there. I'm not going to give it out online, but there's a number included on the Oracle Costume Maker Service page. That's my company. Call that page up so you can need something made or drew out or something. Um, that's pretty much it. So I have to say, um, the other page of Wanting on the Call, get on that. Like that page. The page is mainly about witchcraft and on the occult. On my thoughts of how I take care of things, the way I do things, and that's it. You know, all my Anton or uh, LeVay fans out there, you know, Hell Satan. When I say Hell Satan, I don't mean like that, because again, Satan is an archetype. That's all he is, is a symbol. We don't believe in the God, we don't believe in the devil. We are our own gods, we are our own devils. Hell is here and now, heaven is here. That's how we make it. But in the words of Anton LaVey, hell Satan, and uh, a lot of you should know what I mean by that. Um, read. Do your fucking research. Quit making up bullshit. Quit getting mad because people actually done research and you just didn't like Anton. Keep your bullshit to yourself. Don't say nothing stupid because you will be blocked because this video, like all my videos, is going on Google Plus and YouTube. Enjoy yourself. You know, holidays are here. Drive safe. Don't drink it's like an idiot. You know, if you do drink, drink responsibly. Watch out. You know, winter's almost here. It's practically here now. And uh, that's all I have to say. And uh, stay you and be true. We're out of here.